Kia everybody and welcome back to another workout with us today. Uh, this is Jamie Lee, I am Daz and we are doing a high intensity workout for 30 minutes today. Uh, it's going to be three rounds of four exercises. We're putting in our high intensity in between each of our rounds and we're going to be kicking off with burpees. So make sure you've got your water bottle handy, make sure you've got a towel, a soft surface for anything that we're doing on the ground and we're going to get ready to go in about five seconds. Four, three, starting with our burpees. Let's go. So you're following me for our low intensity and you're following Jamie for full, okay? She's going chest to floor at the moment, coming up, always hands up above your head. If you're with me, we're stepping it out, stepping it in, still doing that nice tall reach, coming up on our toes. Good job, four seconds, let's go. Push it. Well done, good start. We're into our sumo squats, so we're nice and wide. Toes are out and we're trying to get as deep as we can in there. If you've got any weights at home, we hold knees at your chest. We could be adding in a bicep curl here as well. So Jamie's adding in here a sumo squat jump. You with me? We're going as deep as we can again. Nice pull through here. Good job. Shoulders are back. 10 seconds. Well done. Four. Three, keep that core on. Two. All right, we're moving into squat jumps and we're doing two hand touchdowns. So you're jumping up, arms are above head. One, two, touch down. Ready? Let's go. So if you're with me, we're just coming up on our toes, taking off that impact. Make sure as you're doing this squat, as you can see with Jamie, she's really pushing her butt out. Her shoulders are staying back, so she's not reaching over, getting a really big curve through her back. Shoulders are back, sitting into that touch. Two, one, well done. Moving into split lunges. So if you're with Jamie, you're jumping these, and you're trying to square it off. Knees coming close to ground, and we're keeping a nice wide stance. So Amanda often talks about our train tracks, sliding that foot back, so we've got a good base of support. If you're with me, we're just stepping these. Shoulders are staying back. Core's on. Eight seconds there. How are you Jamie Lee? Okay. <laughs> Two. Well done. And we're going straight back up to the top to burpees. Now what we are going to add now is one burpee in each break. Jamie will take you for this. Okay, so we're doing burpees to start with. And then in each break, adding one burpee if you want that extension to what you're doing, okay? Keeps your heart rate up. But as I always say, burpees do wonders for so many parts of your body. It's a great exercise and a great burner in those breaks. And still leaves you time to have a drink of water. So an extra burpee here for Jamie. <laughs> She's not gonna be happy with me at the end of this. And into our sumo squats. Nice. Really sitting into it. Shoulders are staying back. Core's engaged and we're squeezing our butt as we come up. Nice. Our weight's in our heels. Toes are down, but they're not taking any of our weight. Five seconds here. Two. Good job. All right. Yeah, burpee. Good girl, she's got it. All right, we're going to our squat jumps. Remember, hands above head, two touchdowns. Let's go. Coming up on your toes with me. Making sure you're really sitting into it. Awesome. 10 seconds here. Shoulders are back. Chest is up. Four, three, Keep the weight in your heels, well done. Into our split lunges. She's a machine. A lot of respect for this girl. <laughs> Alrighty. So you're either stepping with me, jumping with Jamie. Shoulders are back, core's engaged. We don't want to see you coming too narrow and getting that wobble on. We want to protect our knees. Okay, if knees are an issue for you and lunging is not the thing, then just do that in a squat and you can still be doing that squat coming up onto your toes or doing tap backs here. 
Well done, one burpee in there. And then we're back to burpees, which is pretty mean. Scheme of things. Alrighty, two, one, let's go. Make sure if you're stepping with me, you're alternating the feet that are bringing you in and out. It's not always your right foot going back first. I'm really trying to get that broomstick through your body so you're nice and straight and you don't have butt up in the air or a curve in your back as you're down the bottom here. Three. Squeezing your shoulder blades together. Extra burpee and into our sumo squats. Four. Three. And go. I have an extra challenge for you guys today because we were doing it earlier. Cartwheels, handstands. I ended up having to do a roly-poly, way too old. <laughs> and I tried to protect my bun, so I did a high roly-poly and like slammed down on the ground. So after this, have a bit of fun. Challenge yourself. <laughs> See how you go. <laughs> extra burpee in there for those. You can still be stepping that extra burpee as well. Going into our squat jump, two hand touchdown. Let's go. Oh, I jumped, sorry. <laughs> Just trying to be kind. Coming up on your toes if you're doing that low impact with me. Arms are up. 10 seconds now. Shoulders are back. Beautiful. Four. Two. Good job. Into our split lunges. And then we're into our high intensity. So you get 10 seconds off before our high intensity, so you still do your burpee. And then we'll move to 40 seconds on, and there's no break in the four exercises that we do for our hit. Well done. Slow and control, lower that down. Make sure your knee's not coming out, coming in. We're going straight down. Four. Two. Good job. Extra burpee there. And then we're moving into a blast off plank, okay? So we're coming down here. You've got three seconds, pulling back, driving forward. And go. Now if you're with me, we're coming down onto knees. We can still pull back here. Make sure you're on the surface. It's nice and soft on those knees. Good job. If coming on your knees is a bit too easy, but being up here is just a little bit too far at the moment, you can do a mix. So you can be up as far as you can and pull back, then come to knees. Or your alternative is just to hold the high plank. That could be on elbows or hands, and then drop to knees here. So see where that challenge is. We've got five seconds and we're moving into high knees, straight up on the bell. Two, let's go. Okay, if you're with me, we're marching it. If you're with Jamie, you're running it. High knees, pull them up. Good job. Really challenge yourself here. We want our heart rates up. Shoulders are back. Our core's engaged in every single exercise. Got a finger click that I'm doing today. That's really important. <laughs> High knees. Alrighty. In 10 seconds, we're moving straight into burpees. If you're with Jamie, we're going chest to floor. If you're with me, we're stepping in on the high. Five seconds here. Two. And go. Straight up. Well done. Smashing it, keep going. Remember, alternate those feet if you're stepping with me. Get those arms above your head regardless. Coming up on your toes. Well done, 20 seconds. Now, keep it here. You'll watch Jamie as she comes down. We don't want a big arc in our back as we push off the ground. So engage that core, come up in that straight line, okay? We don't want to see a really big curve through your back. Got nine seconds, we're moving into runner squats. Runner squats, one, two, squatting down. One, two, let's go, here we are. Here with me, that's it. Now if you're stepping with me, we're stepping two, squatting down, nice. Well done, shot Jamie. Twenty seconds here. Do not feel like our aircon in the studio is cutting the mustard today, Jamie. <laughs> 10 seconds, push, push, push. 
net squat, push your butt out, core's engaged, shoulders are back. Five seconds here. Well done, two. Well done, well deserved break. You have 30 seconds off. We're moving into our next four. So first one is a wide stance, low squat, and we're just gonna be pulsing here. That's your first one. Making sure our knees coming over our toes as much as we can. Next is a glute bridge on the floor, and then we're finishing off with a lunge pulse on either side. Okay, we'll just be holding in five seconds, and you're still adding that burpee in your breaks, okay? What am I doing? Put my toes forward. Here we go. Now what you'll notice is Jamie can get a lot lower than me. Wish I could. Okay, but what we don't want to do is put your knees under too much pressure. So get to a point that's comfortable for you. Sit into it. You may find as you pulse that you can get a little bit lower each time. Test that out and really push it so each time you're getting a really thorough workout. Nice. Going into our glute bridge. few variations here. Jamie's going to be doing it where she's going to rock from her toes to her heels. With me, we can just hold here. You can also have a weight that you're holding across your hips. And you can also add a pulse. But for us today, we're just doing that squeeze, pushing our hips up to the roof and holding them up there as long as we can. Eight seconds. Four. Three. Two. Well done. Into our lunge pulse. Alrighty, so our left leg forward. And here we go. So really key, doing those burpees in the breaks because we're doing these pulses to keep your body moving. <laughs> Didn't even notice. I'm in my own land. That's the one. Now again, same thing. You might find that you can come lower each time. And for knees, if the lunge is not working for you, then you can squat pulse this. Okay, for both sides. Other side. Nice. Five seconds here. Three. And go. Okay, again, Amanda, our physio, who I didn't actually talk about before when I said Amanda, our physio who works with us, talks about those train tracks. So imagine you're in your squat and you slide your foot back. Okay, too narrow, you're gonna lose your balance. Knees are forward, toes are forward. That's the one. Five seconds. Three, should we feeling this through those quads? And break, one burpee. Back to our wide stance, low squat. Good job, nice job. <laughs> she put so much love into that. <laughs> hey, 70% is better than no percent. <laughs> oh dear. They know, you know, you know what to do. We've always said, we're just the models. <laughs> you take it at your own pace and your own heights for your jumps. Three, two, well done. Into our glute bridge. Nice, Jamie. She's getting there now, look at her. Just needed a warm up. <laughs> Alrighty, remember all those different variants. You can be going rocking, heels to toes. You can be pulsing, you can have your weight. But just make sure we don't get that dip and hold here. Squeeze your butt, push your hips to the roof. That's the one. You've got eight seconds left, hold it up. Real easy to forget, so just keep reminding yourself, hold it up, push. Two, one, nice, into our lunge pulse. Left foot forward. And go. Another trick here, if you're wanting to, is to have a wall nice and close, so you've just got a little bit of balance, but don't lean on it, okay? So it's just there as a guide to support that balance for you. Tuck your hips under, pull tummy mutton to tailbone. That's the one. Four, three, two, nice. <laughs> you mean that from a non-injury perspective, right? <laughs> <laughs> and go, coming down. If you do need to take a break in these pulses, just straighten your legs up and come back into it, okay? But don't just stop and go, oh, I am done. <laughs> take the break and come back. 10 seconds here. 
You got it. If it's not challenging you enough, see if you can push yourself just a little bit lower. Two, one, well done. Into your burpee. Wide stance, low squat. Well done, Jamie. Two, and go. Here we are. I love a good pulse, honestly. After you've done a bit more leg work, gold. Toes are forward. Did you say it's your favourite or mine? Yours. Nah, burpees. Anything, pulse. Yeah. <laughs> pulse. pulse. And hold and pulse. Five seconds. Keep it going. Three. Well done. Go at bridge. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Got this. Three. Two. Hold it up. Let's go. Okay, weight's coming through your heels. So technically, my toes are not in use right now, but they're staying flat to the floor. That's the one. Again, remember, your other thing too here is to have it square. So you might find that you're a bit stronger on your left, and you might find that you get a bit wobbly there. So just make sure, try and really level out those hips. Three seconds here. Well done, lunge pulse. Left foot forward. Nice, Jamie. She's got a rush now. Yeah. Ah, here we go. <laughs> oh dear. I love our job. <laughs> She's fun to hang out with. Alrighty, 15 seconds. <laughs> she had to say that, but it's fine. 10 now. Come on. This is the last one of these, so try and get a little bit lower. Really push it so that you come out of this. Slapping that leg and being joyful that it's over. Three, two, like that. Train track, set it up, five seconds, two, and down. Good job. Remember, shoulders are back, hips are tucked under to move that pelvis. Core's on, 15 seconds here. Well done. And 10. Oh, she's getting me now. That face is getting Jamie too. Three, <laughs> two, one, well done. One burpee here. And then we're moving into our high intensity. Just first that blast off. So we're coming down to our plank. And you pull back, drive forward. Ready? Let's go. Okay, that's your full. Options are down on our knees, pull back, drive forward. Other one, hold our plank here. If that pull back for both is too hard, then just hold, not too hard. Not yet at that level. Then holding that plank here. Okay, lots of options, just keep in it. Even if you do that pull until you can't, and then hold there, that's brilliant. Moving into our high knees in 10 seconds. Keep going. Well done, four. Here we go. High knees. <laughs> I know how to burn out legs, right? <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> so running it with Jamie, stepping it with me, dig deep here. Now make sure for this next round that you've got a water bottle or a weight, a ball, anything handy that you can just tap your feet to. It's just off the floor. I'm doing some toe taps. We've got 10 seconds here. Then we're moving to our chest to floor burpees in five, straight into it. Three. Two, let's go. <laughs> oh dear. Drive it out, alternate those legs. If you're stepping with me, come up on your toes, arms above your head, core's engaged. As we're down in our plank, squeezing your shoulder blades together to get that really good position here. Dig deep. You got it. Squeeze those shoulder blades. 10 seconds. Well done. Eight here. Push, push, push. Four. Moving into our runner squats. One, two. That's it. Feel with me. Two front taps. Squatting down. Pushing our butt out. Pushing through our heels. Well done. Make sure you check out our technique talks, Amanda. 
We already talked about the different ways we're squatting and what elements to focus on to make sure we're activating all the right muscles. So pushing through our heels, making sure we're taking care of our knees and engaging our thighs. Three. Well done. 30 seconds off. She's a machine. Alrighty, so next round, we've got push-ups. We've got our toe tap, so you're gonna have a bottle in front of you or a weight, you're toe tapping. We're doing bunny hop planks <laughs> and we're jumping forward and doing star jumps back. Three rounds of that, finishing with our high intensity. We're done and we're out of here. Starting with our push-ups, let's go. If you're with Jamie here, she's on full. Key things to remember is that we've got our broomstick running through here. So we're squeezing our shoulder blades together and we're keeping a nice straight line through our body. We don't want to be pushing up off the ground, having a big curve, or opposite, having our butts in the air, okay? Nice broomstick running through our body. Slow lower down, fast drive up. That's the one. Nice, she's still into those burpees. Proud of her. All right, bottle toe taps. If you've got a weight, if you've got a bottle, something in front of you, and you're just trying to tap as you go. With me, we're gonna stay in our squat low. We're tapping forward. These are what I like to call a rich man squat. Most people don't know what I'm talking about, but it's a musical from a long time ago, guys. That's the one. If I was a rich man. See, some people do know what I'm talking about too. Nice, okay, we're into that burpee again. Then we're moving to our bunny hop planks. Okay, bunny hop plank, we're down here. You're squeezing those shoulder blades, you're in the right spot. Jumping forward, back, forward and back. Take that at your own pace. If you're with me, we can just be holding our plank. You can hold your plank on full. We could just be stepping, and doing that toe tap to the side. You can also still be doing that while you're on your knees. That's the one, five seconds here. Beautiful, two. Well done. Last of our four is a big power jump forward and then we start jumping back. In two, alrighty. Big jump forward, star jumps back. Now if you're with me, we're taking that as a step. And we're staying in the low squat as we come back. Big step forward, we're gonna do our little steps back. Beautiful. Keep going, really drive out of it. Whether you're stepping, whether you're jumping. Drive, 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 stay low. Nice, into your burpee, and we're back to our push-ups. Make sure you're keeping that nice straight line through your body so as you come up out of that burpee, we have not, ugh, we're not getting not in the curve. Alrighty, slow and controlled, lower down, fast drive up. We don't wanna see looking underneath our bodies as we come down, okay? Looking straight down, just in front. Slow and controlled, lower down, fast drive up. Five seconds. Pull tummy button to tailbone. Keep that core engaged. Nice. Toe taps. If you're with me, remember, rich man squat. Beautiful. Look at those high knees. Good work, Jamie Lee. Keep smashing it, keep going. 15 seconds here. Shoulders are back. Core's engaged. Eyes are up. Well done. Three, two, well done. Bunny hop plank. Nice, Jamie. Nice, everybody at home. Alrighty. Remember your options. Jumping up there with Jamie. You can be holding it here with me. You can be doing that step. Either side. Want to make sure if we're doing that step that our hips aren't rocking too much and then we're not getting that curve in our back. So really trying to make sure that technique is on point. Otherwise, down here on our knees, you can still be doing that tap or hold. Well done. Jump forward, star jumps back, or little feet back with me. Two, one, staying low. Nice soft landings. 
Making sure we're taking care of those knees the best we can. That's the one. Lovely. <laughs> she almost face planted into the camera, but she's good. Saved it. I'll just smash into the couch instead. <laughs> and burpees. Alrighty. Last one, back into our push ups. You got it. Three. Nice. Slow and controlled, lower down. Fast drive up. Core's on. Pull tummy button to tailbone. You got it. Don't know about everybody else, but when I'm doing a knee push up, I find it's harder if I have my toes tapping on the ground. If I have it up here, for some reason, way easier. Here, a lot harder for me to do. So test that out for yourself too. Nice. Toe taps. Well done. Three, two, and go. Remember, bridge man squats, we stay nice and low. Good job. Keep that pace once you've set it, hold it there. We're almost finished for the day. Five seconds, shoulders back, core's on. Keep it up. Two, well done. Bunny hop plank. Five. Alrighty. Remember all your different options here. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Looking straight down. Good job. Got 10 seconds here. Keep it on. Nice straight line running through those bodies. Three. Well done. Jump forward. Star jumps back. Last one of these. Then we've got our high intensity. And you can rest. Alrighty. Little, little, little feet with me. Beautiful. I'm trying to get in time with it, but it's just too fast for me. Good job. Control that landing. Here with me, alternate those feet. Shoulders are still staying back. Core's on, three. Beautiful. One burpee. Then we're into our hit. Then we're all over. So starting off that blast off plank, coming down. Good job. Pulling back, driving forward. Making sure we're not looking underneath our body. Looking straight down. Beautiful. If you want to, on your knees, pull back, drive forward. Just make sure whatever it is, we're resetting our hips, straight line through our body. 20 seconds here. If the knee pull is too little, but the big pull is too much, again, hold your plank, or hold your plank here on your knees. You've got 10 seconds to go. Remember, test out those feet up, feet down. See what works. The high knees in three seconds. Here we go. Marching it with me, running it with Jamie. Almost there. Second to last exercise. That's not true. Third to last exercise. Shouldn't lie. People already just trust a personal trainer. It's not cool, guys. I'm sorry. 20 seconds. Keep moving. Don't give up. So close. I'm going chest to floor burpees in 10 seconds. Stepping in with me. And that high plank, five, push yourself. Three, two, make sure those arms come up. Let's go. Well done. Keep that good technique. Real easy now when we're tired. Start getting lazy, broomstick through our body. Not pushing up and having a curve through our back. That's the one. Stepping out, alternating the feet we go out on. Core's engaged. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. 10 seconds. Keep pushing. You got it, and then we're into our runner squats to finish. Let's go. That's it. Two front taps here with me. 
Pushing through those heels. Butts out. Last one of the day. Minus strong. 20 here. That's it. 15. Push, push, push. Nice. Five. Two. Well done. Well done. Well done, Jamie. Well done, you're at home. You smashed it. Another one you can tick off the list on whichever journey you are on. Thank you for joining us today. Make sure you have a really big drink of water. Make sure you have a snack just to replenish those systems. Have a really good stretch now. Take time to talk to your friends. Make sure you book your next workout. And we will see you again soon. Kaki te.